I'm Rudyard Griffiths, co-founder of Triton Foils. Welcome to this, our T1 mono wing product demonstration. Who is this wing for? Well, we've tested it extensively, and our feeling is that this wing is accessible to anyone who's an intermediate hydrofoiler and up. By intermediate, I mean anyone who can jibe. If you can loop and jibe your kite, you can ride uh, this wing. I think this wing is especially attractive and interesting for advanced hydrofoilers who want to take their foiling to the next level, who want to push their limits on a new piece of technology. We're really excited about the performance envelope of this wing and what it can do for intermediate and advanced foilers. So what is the, the way you describe this wing? Well, we really have two characteristics that come top of mind to us. The first is a freestyle wing. Uh, this is a remarkable wing for just being out there, turning, carving, tacking. It makes tacking so easy. It's also a wing that takes maybe your local spot where you're kind of mowing the lawn on your foil and you're a little bit bored, frankly, about the experience, and it kicks it up to that next level. It creates a whole new set of challenges and opportunities for you to explore again the limits of your foiling and the limits of this really innovative design. It's also a wing that we've used extensively now in wave conditions. There's some video of this on our website, you can check it out. Really again, interesting wave characteristics. Beautiful manners down the wave face. The fact that it's uh, low profile with uh, a thicker camber allows you to avoid racing down the wave. It gives you a nice ride oh. down the wave with nice. a lot, again, of incredible carving and turning ability. So we're excited about the potential of the T1 mono wing as a wave foiling wing. In sum, uh, this is really a, a wing for a person who's looking for a new feel, a new dimension for their foiling. This is not gonna replace your own traditional favorite foil. That's not why we created the T1 mono wing. The T1 mono wing is uh, a new variety. It's like having a new kite or a new board. It's another thing that you can add to your quiver to create that really fascinating multiplier effect that we all experience out of foiling. That new piece of gear that makes your kites behave differently. That new piece of gear that, again, makes your board and your mast have uh, you know, some new characteristic, uh, some new dimension uh, for you to test your limits on. So let's talk now about the performance characteristics of the T1 Mono. As you can see, this is a very low aspect wing. And again, just to state the obvious, there is no stabilizer, no fuselage, all that is gone. This is a pure mono wing. And one of the first mono wings that we think has been created that is accessible. There are other mono wings out there and we salute the designers who've been creating them, but this is much more than just cutting off the stabilizer and the rear wing and calling something a mono wing. You'll note that the mast connects directly into the center surface of the wing. And what's really neat about this design is you don't need a special or customized mast. The vast majority of existing masts, as long as they have a flat mast base, mast foot, will work on this wing. I'll explain a little bit more later about the adaptability and compatibility function of the T1, but we think it's a really interesting selling point of this wing. This is not a wing that you gotta go out and buy a whole bunch of new gear to experience. Again, the vast majority of existing masks are fully compatible with this wing. You can throw this wing in your travel bag, in the back of your truck, and after you've enjoyed your favorite foil with its rear stabilizer and its fuselage, you can pop on the T1 and have a completely new and different experience. Let's talk about size. The square uh, centimeters here are about 1,800. So that sounds big, but remember, there's no rear stabilizer, so you're losing the three to 400 uh, square centimeters that you'd normally have 
in the rear stabilizer. So I think you want to think of this wing as you know, a 1400 or so front wing, which gives you some interesting performance characteristics. There are a variety of design components in the wing that have allowed us to deal with the major engineering challenge that we had to address, which is the lack of a fuselage and a stabilizer. And for those of you who are experienced with foiling, you know that the, the rear stabilizer is what creates in front of the wing your front foot pressure. So the, the kind of magic of this wing and the, the math in this wing that's really special is it creates that front foot pressure for you, which has traditionally been a drawback of mono wings, their inability to create front foot pressure. This one does, and it does it without a fuselage and a stabilizer. Finally, on weight, we're talking 1,250 grams total for the wing which if you're like me and you're a bit obsessed about not paying checked baggage fees, this starts to get to become a really interesting, ultra light, ultra compact travel option where you could literally take this wing, say an 80, 70 centimeter mast, a sub one meter board, stick it all in your travel bag with a kite or two, and you're checking that on to the plane, you're walking that bag onto the plane, you're not putting it in the luggage. So an interesting kind of travel dimension to explore with this wing. Let me now move on to, to build components because we're really proud of what has been a two plus year journey to create this wing involving aerospace engineers, PhDs, professors, both here in Canada and uh, in Germany. And again, a lot of engineering, a lot of insights, a lot of painful prototyping that we had to go through to come up with this final consumer-ready, production-ready uh, T1 mono wing. The first thing, as I mentioned, is the compatibility piece. Uh, so what we have here in the wing is a slot that allows you to adjust for the different screw spacing on foils in terms of the connection of usually the fuselage to the mast. So we've designed this so that it accommodates most masts. Again, there are some masts that it won't accommodate. You can email us, go to our website. We're happy to answer your questions and confirm that your mast is 100% compatible. But the vast majority of masts are compatible because we've allowed you to adjust for the spacing between your bolt holes at the base of your mast. And again, you're not connecting to a fuselage, you're connecting directly to the top surface of the T1 mono wing. The next neat thing about this wing is for reasons of strength and stability, we built it with a solid resin block around uh, the mass to wing connection area. This whole area is a solid resin block. So you can really crank this wing onto your mast and you can be assured that you're not damaging the carbon or stressing the carbon. The rest of the wing is built in beautiful, gorgeous, multi-layer uh, carbon uh, that uh, has been finished to a really high quality. We're just so happy with the quality of the build on this wing. And you know some other small features that we built in that experienced uh, wing buyers would appreciate you know, we've wrapped the carbon over the front of the wing. So this isn't two surfaces being pressed together with a seam along the front. This has multiple layers of carbon fiber fabric wrapped around the edges, creating a lot of uh, strength and, and stability. These wings are available right now on our website, www.tritonfoils.com. We're manufacturing in small batches to ensure really a high quality superlative build. And as you can see, really beautiful uh, finish on the product. Uh, you can order uh, online uh, through our website. We're also happy at Triton Foils to answer any of your questions uh, about this wing. We've got a form on our website. Simply go on. If you've got compatibility questions, if you've got ride questions, uh, we've been testing this wing out extensively now, 
And we've got a lot of insights uh, that we can share with you. We've also got a lot of videos on our website where you can see this wing performing in different environments, flat water, surf, uh, et cetera. Finally, we're excited about possible extensions of this wing into wing foiling. Um, I'm personally not a wing foiler, but uh, we're gonna be having some videos soon of people wing foiling this because at 1800 centimeters, it's definitely square centimeters, it's definitely in that envelope for wing foilers. And hey, if you enjoy wake foiling, this could be another fun toy uh, behind the boat to experience, again, just an incredibly fun, carvy, playful feel, nothing like a traditional foil, uh, something very special, something very unique, something that we're hugely excited about at Trident Foils. Mono wing is killing it. So thank you for your time, uh, for spending uh, a few minutes with us to learn about the new T1 Mono Wing. I'm Rudyard Griffiths, co-founder of Triton Foils, with my colleague Chris Meisner. Uh, please visit our website, check out our YouTube channel, uh, Instagram feeds, and uh, join the T1 Mono Wing revolution. We think you'll really enjoy this ride.